So in this video, I'm creating my first proper sculpture. Well, I got to say, in the past, I've already semi-sculpted this little figure, but for this video, it's not gonna be anything like this. In fact, I want to translate my own art style into the sculpture. So, without further ado, enjoy the video. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you like the video at any point. It's completely free and you would help me out a lot. And with that being said, it's time to get going with this project. So I jumped behind my desk and wrote myself a list of all the tools and materials needed to produce an art toy. For once, everything I need I have at home, so let's get her all stuff. <laughs> are you alive? <laughs> and that's about everything I need. And in case you're interested, I've listed all the materials in the description of this video. So now, let's crack on with the sketch and design the art toy. And I do already have an idea in mind. No. Just realized something very important. It got to fit the oven, of course. Which was pretty vital to know since I wanted to draw a full scale model on the paper. Later on in the video, you'll see that this will make my life so much easier. Sketch done, so now let's start crafting this art toy. First of all, before I can start working with the clay, I have to make a base skeleton with wire and aluminum foil. And since my sketch is already at the right scale, I can use it as a guideline to create the skeleton. At the moment, I have no idea what I'm doing. Skeleton done, so now time to smack some clay on it and get some real sculpting done. Which is pretty much the most exciting part, but also the most scary part. And I have to admit, I was a bit nervous. Let's go for it. I tried to sculpt as clean as possible, but it still looks a little bit wonky. So let's clean it up. My god, this is time consuming. Luckily, about one hour later, I was done. So now I just had to go through the exact same process with the line head. And with that task marked of the to-do list, I could finally start to sculpt everything together and adding those delicious doodles to the mix. Let's give it my all one more time. Let's go! After an entire week, the battle with the clay is over. However, before I could close the project, I had to do one more last thing. And that of course was to give it a nice smooth white color. And on that note, it all came to an end. Well, 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 <laughs> it's done. I'm not gonna lie. I was pretty nervous throughout this entire project. This is out of my comfort zone, but it's something I've been wanting to do for such a long time. And man, I personally can't be more happy with the end result. And of course, I'm gonna show you a proper reveal of the end result in just a second. But first, a little bit of a shameless plug here. If you like this one of a kind sculpture, you might want to consider taking a look at my website, bamsway.com, because I actually made the sculpture available on the webshop. So if you're interested in 
owning this one of a kind piece then you know what to do but anyways guys i really hope you liked the video and then i hope to see each other very soon in a new video take care